Hello, this is Aldo from ExcelNinja.com. Uh, today I'm going to show you how to create a random list from a starting point that is this particular list of 27 surnames. Um, it could be customers, it could be people working in your company, and you want to create a really long list that is in a random order, just basically starting from this 27 uh, surname. So what you'll do as you can see I've already done here, you put a number next to the list of surname from 1 to in this case 27 and this will form the basis of the VLOOKUP function that we'll be using. Uh, next, let's say that you want to create a list and put it here in these two columns and go, go on forever and ever. If you need a thousand, a hundred or a thousand uh, values, it doesn't matter. You can do how many you want. What you'll do, you'll select the RAN between function RND, RAND between. And what Excel asks you is to basically select a bottom and a top number that it will choose a, a random number between. So in our case, it will be uh, 1 and 27 which is the, the range that we have. Close parentheses and here you go. And as you can see, it's giving us two, the first uh, number. What uh, the particular thing about this random between function is that it gives you integers. Um, excuse me. It gives you integers uh, as opposed to the RAND rand function because that will give you from zero to one. In this case, you can select the bottom and the top value that you want a random number in between. Having said that, so you got number two. Once you um, have this number two, then you can create, use a VLOOKUP function, VLOOKUP function, where you basically tell Excel, okay, look up this number, and you, I want you to go and have a look in this range. So you select the whole range and then you fix it with a 4 so that D4 and E30 are fixed and then the next thing you'll say I want the second value of that range to appear in the in that particular cell. So as you can see now it's 21 and it goes and pick number 21 and it's Smith as you can see. So we'll what we'll do now we'll copy and we'll can go for on forever and ever however you want paste and there you go that's your random list so basically it could for instance be a random list of customer calls or things like that. What there's a few things to clarify about this as you can see this every time that for instance you press F9 Excel will update rechoose the um, reselect the uh, fresh a fresh um, list essentially so that you can basically uh, update the list as you wish if you want to um, make it permanent you just copy you go to the right for instance and you pay special and you press values and that's it. As you can see this has been updated once again whereas this one is now fixed in time and you can use it for whatever purpose you want. So again just to summarize the function that you want is ran between, random between and you choose the top and the bottom values and this for in, in this instance is 1 and 27 which gives us then a range that we can choose from to use in the VLOOKUP function that basically gives us the uh, uh, the ability to generate a random list.